and good morning. We are here at the Olympic Oval this morning and starting with the 500 meters. The Oval Invitational Skaters and we're on pair 7 of 17 with Danielle Wallace on the inner and Sylvie Lloyd on the outer. Wallace opens with a 12.08 and Lloyd 11.84. We apologize for the late start this morning with the webcast. There were some technical difficulties, but we've got them under control. And we're happy to have you joining us this morning. And it looks like Wallace is coming to the line to take the win. Her final time is 42.99 and Lloyd 43.75. At the line now we have pair 8 with Jenna Mirth of Alberta on the inner and Anna Bourgeois of Alberta on the outer. And they get off to a clean start. Mirth opens first in a time of 11.9 and Bourgeois close behind in a 12.29. We have coach Arno Huveld on the back stretch and Mike Ireland cheering on their skaters. And Jenna wins this pair in a time of 43.37 with Bourgeois at 44.04. .04. And next in pair nine, we have Shruti Cotwell of India on the inner and Amanda Mitchell of BC on the outer. And they get off to a quick start. And Mitchell opens in a time of 12.24 and Cotwell in 12.37. This is shaping up to be quite a close race. As these ladies race to the finish, we have Mitchell in final time of 44.37 and Cotwell in 44.88. Here's our leaderboard for you. We have Alessandra Inkolescu in first, Courtney Schmier second, and Sarah Spence in third. In this next pair, we have Rose-Anne Grenier of Quebec and Kirsten Hagen of BC. There's a little slip for Hagen right off the line, but it looks like she's recovered. And she gets to the opening line first. Hagen with a 12.26 and Grenier with 12.48. We have coach Gregor Jelinek of Quebec on the back stretch, encouraging his skater, Grenier.
as these women race, race to the finish. We have Kristen, Kirsten Hagen with 43.88 and Grenier with a 44.19. Oh, she fell after the line, but it looks like she's okay. Uh, sometimes your legs are just exhausted. Coach Arno Hoogveld is helping her up, making sure she's fine and checking the blocks, putting them back in place. As we get going with pair 11. On the, oh, they've stopped the start just to make sure that the corner is okay and that the ice is fine. The blocks are back in place, and the referees have made sure that the ice is in good condition, and we're ready to go with this pair. On the inner, we have Olivia Scott from Ontario, and on the outer, Cassidy Peterson of Alberta. And Peterson opens in a time of 12.8 with Scott at 12.52. We have another coach on the back stretch there, Jeff Katura, encouraging his skater, along with Arno Hoogveld. And Olivia wins this pair with a time of 44.04 .04 and Peterson 45.61. Yeah. And next up we have pair 12. On the inner from Manitoba, Emma Javra. And on the outer from Ontario, Lily Weideman. And that was a clean start. And Lily Weideman opens with a time of 12.4 and Jabra 12.8. Wow. Lily is the younger sister of Isabel Weideman, who is on the national team, along with her younger brother, Jake Weideman, who has qualified to be part of the Next Gen program with the national team. And Lily will win this pair with a time of 45.31 and Emma Javra 46.19. Pair 13 is on the line. In the inner, from Manitoba, we have Chloe Bouchain. And on the outer, from Alberta, Sophie Pett. And we had the start called back. It was a false start by the inner lane. Some movement on the line. That's one strike. So if someone here does another false start, they will be disqualified from the race. Let's hope they get off to a clean start. And they're good. 
racing down the front straightaway. We have Beauchene opening in 12.48 and Pet 12.42, 72, sorry. We have two coaches on the back stretch that used to be part of the national program. Tyler Dara and Mike Ireland. Beauchene is leading this pair to the finish with a time of 45.18 and Sophie Pett 45.97. There's the leaderboard again, unchanged since the last time we showed you. Jan Kulescu with a 39.43, Schmier 40.11, and Spence with a 40.34. In pair 14, we have Ashley Hanna from Manitoba on the inside, and she's racing today without a pair as her pair, Samara 2, has scratched. Hannah opens in a time of 12.67. After the women's races here, we have the men going in the 500 meters. After this pair, we have three races to go, two races to go. Ashley Hanna crosses the line with a time of 45.28. On the line now, we have pair 15 with Jasmine Chase from Ontario on the inner and Jessica Conrad of Alberta on the outer. small delay here on the start and the ladies are keeping warm, shaking their legs and preparing for the start. And we're ready to begin. And they're off to a clean start. With one lap to go, Chase opens in a time of 12.72 and Conrad 13.63. On the back stretch, the skaters are required to switch lanes. And now Chase will be in the outer and Conrad on the inner. And Chase crosses the line in a time of 45.47 and Conrad 48.12. Prepared to start, we have pair 16, Martina Antefe from BC and Callie Ann Friesen from Saskatchewan. There was a little movement on the start, and the referee has called back the skaters. The referee is indicating that the, the skater with the white armband has false started, and that would be the inner lane.
and this time they're off to a clean start. Antifa opens in a time of 12.4 with freezing at 13.05. As you can see, Antifa is not wearing a hood. She is wearing a short track skin suit. And Kalyan Friesen, as you can tell, is wearing a long track suit. And they come to the line. Antifa doing great on the long track. Her time is 46.24 and Friesen 47.77. Next is the final pair for the women. Pair 17 with Danica Grierson uh, from Manitoba on the inner and Emma Varden of Ontario on the outer. Following this pair, there will be a flood break, and the men will begin at 9.45. Varden opens at 12.94, and Grierson opens in 13.18. And the final time for Varden is 47.42 and Grierson with a 48.8. <coughs> with the final leaderboard on your screen, Alexander Ian Kolescu from Romania is first, Court Ishmir of Alberta is second, and Sarah Spence of BC finishes in third place. <laughs> 